The Borno State Government says it has set in motion moves to boost its agricultural sector with massive investments. This, the government believes, would afford farmers to go back to farming with improved security now enjoyed in the state. Senior reporter Jesse Tafida has details. The 13 year old conflict in Borno has dealt a big blow to the agricultural sector which usually contributes up to 65% of the state's gross domestic product. The state has, in the last nine years, lost more than 500,000 metric tons of food due to insurgency. But the Zulum-led government has prioritized the agricultural sector in its 10 packed development agenda. Supporting security operatives in the state with numerous logistics is the first step taken to address issues of insecurity. This has assisted farmers to go back to their farmland as a result of relative peace. We are trying to look into medium and longer term sustainable solutions that will completely address food crisis in Borno State. To this effect, the Borno State Government, under the Ministry of Agriculture, has taken far-reaching decisions that will address the food crisis. Among them is the re-establishment of irrigation schemes in Borno State. We have identified four very important areas where people have started irrigation. What government will do is to uh, re-excavate their existing dams, construct new ones, provide them with water pumps of which we have started. Governor Baba Ganazulum, within his first year of his second tenure, has initiated 29 new projects in 13 local council areas, revived irrigation farming, procurement of farming input and equipment, and distribution of cash to farmers. The main vision of the state government, amongst others, and with that of the federal government, is to clear this bad land support the communities with agricultural inputs, fertilizers, seeds, so that food production will be enhanced in Borno State. And this will also ensure sustainable food supply, not only to the Borno State, but to Nigeria in general. This move by the state government is geared towards boosting the state economy and food production. Jesse Tafida, TVC News, Maiduguri.